Hello everyone, this is Isa's video tutorial on how to partition a hard drive on Windows 10. Why do you need to partition a hard drive? There is only one partition, usually C drive, on your computer, and you want to create or resize partitions. Partitioning a hard drive makes it easier to organize files and make full use of disk space. Optimizing disk space can enhance system performance and even help to create a backup and recovery partition. Preparations to partition a hard drive First, make sure there is enough space on the drive you want to partition. Then, download the partition management software, ESA's Partition Master. How to check disk space? Right-click this PC, click Manage, and click Disk Management. Here, you'll see all the drives that are currently inserted into your computer, including internal HDD or SSD, external hard drive, and USB flash drive. To download ESA's Partition Master, go to ESA's.com, find Partition Master Professional at the top of the navigation. Click the free trial button to download the software, finish the installation and activation. Now let's see how to use this partition manager to partition a hard drive on Windows 10 step by step. Open ESA's Partition Master, you can see there are two disks on my computer. We'll show you how to manage partitions on disk 0. First, you'll see how to shrink and create a partition without deleting. Right-click the partition that you want to shrink and select Resize or Move. Here, let's choose D drive. To shrink a partition, use your mouse to drag one of its ends to shrink partition space. You can also adjust the partition size box to shrink the target partition. Then click OK. Now right click the unallocated space and select Create. Set the size, partition label, drive letter, file system, etc. for the new partition and click OK. Now you'll see two operations are waiting to be executed. Click Execute and click Apply to keep all changes after each operation, or execute them all at last. If you are partitioning a system drive or a partition in use, you'll be prompted to reboot your computer. Click Yes and wait for the process to complete. You can also create a new partition by deleting the unwanted drive. Right-click the drive partition which you want to delete and select Delete. Click OK to confirm. Then repeat the previous steps of creating a new partition with unallocated space. Next, we'll show you how to extend a partition with or without unallocated space. If there is unallocated space on your hard disk, right-click the target partition and select Resize or Move. Drag the target partition handle into the unallocated space to extend partition. If there is no or insufficient unallocated space, use the Advanced Partition Resizing function to directly allocate free space from other partitions to the target drive without deleting or formatting. Find the Allocate Space From option, then click Select Partition. Choose the partition from which you want to allocate space. Drag the partition panel rightward or leftward to resize the partition you want to extend, then click OK to confirm. Click Execute and click Apply to keep the changes and extend your partition. It's that simple. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe.